with the good woman. Tell us about the partnership with Winston Marsalis and other partnerships around the globe. You know what, I'm trying to stay in touch and be friends with the best jazz musician in the world. And one of them, Winton Marsalis. And he's a trumpeter, he played classical music, and he won several Grammys in classical music, and he also won Grammys in jazz music. He also the director of a jazz at Lincoln Center, and he runs a big, big uh, concert uh, organization and a museum of jazz, and uh, also radio that, uh, that uh, broadcasts jazz. So he's a great musician and a great uh, producer and, and, uh, and uh, you know, and entrepreneur. So also I fr I'm a friend with Chick Corea, who is a pianist and a composer, an amazing man. Herbie Hancock also, a legend in, in, in music and jazz. He won Granny for the, for the best album, not only in jazz, but for the best album of, of all. So also I'm a friend with, uh, with Minister of Defense of Russian Federation, play hockey. and I'm also friends with the Russian President Vladimir Putin, who play hockey and, and the like my music. So, can you tell me about a little bit about the passion for hockey? Passion for hockey is uh, something that I started playing hockey when I was about maybe four years old, and uh, just in my hometown in St. Petersburg, just I put some warm shoes and you know warm <laughs> so-called valenki, and uh, we played hockey with the sticks that we could get in the store, but they were very heavy. But we love to play hockey. And we love to watch hockey, and I was, you know, watching all the best games in the Soviet Union. The Soviet Union played this really fantastic hockey with the Canadian uh, counterparts, but it was great hockey, great friendship. And then I just fell out, and I went to Red Army team, and I, it was in a Red Army hockey club, for a hockey scout, a hockey club school, for maybe six years. And since then, I, I you know, I've been, I loved hockey. Since then, I'm playing. I played in Russia, then when I went to the United States, I played in the United States with some amateur teams. And I enjoyed myself, and still playing now. What made you choose between having a career of music or having a career of like a hockey player? You know, hockey player is a quite short uh, career for the time was. And, uh, and also there was, uh, I feel like I'm, I really want to do music. I can uh, be creative. I really was inspired by a lot of the musicians in my family. Uh, also, some of my people from my family, my grandfather, my father was were musicians, and I, I liked it. So I kept hockey as my passion, as my hobby. But I decided the music was more interesting for me. So on November first, twenty eighteen, you got a peace prize. Can you yes. tell me a little about that? Oh, well, it's not only me, but that we got a peace prize with Winter and Marsalis because we're trying to bring with our music people together. We want, we want to make all our people with the different opinions on different things uh, to come and listen to music, smile, and just think that it's not, uh, that, that they could find some compromises because it's much more beautiful stuff on the planet than just fight. So we thank that for, for what we, we do, we got an award. Um, so, how did you meet Winston Marsalis? I met him, you know, we feel like we knew each other because we talked to each other on the phone, but we also watch uh, ourselves on TV and the people were talking about me. People were telling Winston about me. You know, of course, I knew Winston because I heard him the first time on the radio. But then we met in Moscow at the jam session when he came with his orchestra and we immediately became a friend. Thank you for your time. You're welcome. <laughs>